Welcome to Training Center Cape May and welcome to Coast Guard Recruit Training. You are about to begin the most difficult job interview of your life. There are no guarantees here. If you do not meet or exceed every standard of our program, you will not graduate from Training Center Cape May and you will not earn the privilege or the right to serve as a Coast Guardsman. Is that understood? Sir, yes, sir! You truly are the best volunteers our nation has to offer. We know you have what it takes, but over the next eight weeks, we are going to test you to ensure you have the desire to join us in our service. We are going to push you mentally. We are going to test you physically. And we are going to stretch the emotional limits. You are going to face seemingly impossible tasks. We are going to test your desire to serve, and we are going to work to prepare you for the rigors of service in the United States Coast Guard. We know that if you won't quit here, you won't quit out there. When your lives are on the line, your shipmates' lives are on the line, and the lives of those you are supposed to protect are on the line as well. We have to ensure that you are ready to serve as our shipmates and that you are ready to protect, defend, save, and shield our nation and our waterways from all who seek to do us harm. I hope that you have prepared yourself for training with this in mind. This is not just eight weeks. This is the challenge and potentially the opportunity of a lifetime. This is Training Center Cape May. Your future as a Coast Guardsman starts here. Are you ready? Sir, yes, sir! Are you ready? Sir, yes, sir! Then I think we are about to find out. Sound off! Good morning, Coach. This is Tom Vorholt. I played free safety on that 1971 team at Elder. Best seat in the house, admission free, saw every game. Can never remember where I put my keys 15 minutes ago, but I do remember every game that season from Woodward right through Western Hills, with the exception of Lancaster. I don't know if I took a shot in the head, but I don't remember much about that game in particular. But at any rate, we um living down in uh, New Orleans. Um, the majority of the time is that's where I'm working now, but we keep a home in, in Nashville. Is, this is where we raised our four children, and we also have a home in, in Naples, Florida. Uh, we enjoy the tropical climate down there. But I wanted to say thanks uh, for all that you've done for me over the years, Coach. It, uh, obviously, Elder was a very formative time in my life, and the football program was a big part of that. It prepared me well for four years at the U.S. Coast Guard Academy and the rigors of um, the academic program, the military regimen, and Division Three football. But the main thing I wanted to say, Coach, was Greg Gruenwald obviously has done a great job uh, keeping us advised of, of your of your health and your condition. And uh, we want to assure you of our continued prayers for um, nothing but the best for you in 2016, Coach, and and that your health will continue to improve. So again, thank you for all you've done.